filter feeding. Sponges are the simplest of multicellular animals. They are often confused for being plants because of their simplicity. They have no organ system and are characterized by numerous pores called ostea. The body has a central mouth-like opening called the osculum. Water enters the sponge body through the ostea and then is eliminated from the body through the osculum. Osteum is surrounded by donut-like cells called porocytes. These porocytes open and close to control the flow of water. An internal view of the sponge shows that water flows through the osteum directly into an open space called spongo seal. The interior of the spongo seal is lined with flagellated cells called coanocytes or collar cells. Coanocytes have a tubular collar and flagellum extends from the center. The flagellum helps to draw water along with food particles into coanocytes. The food is absorbed into the coanocyte but it's not digested here. It is passed on to amoebocyte, which is seen moving around in the basoglia. These amoebocytes digest the food and carry it to other parts of the body. Here, we also find some spicules. The outermost layer is the layer of epidermal cells. So from the outside, we can see water entering through the ostea and moving out through the osculum or mouth. This method of nutrition is called filter feeding.